When the public is stifled by this trend of political correctness, where if you report something, you're going to be accused by groups like the Council on American Islamic Relations or the media as being Islamophobic, what happens? San Bernardino happens, where you have people who said literally, I did not report my neighbor who I knew was engaged in illicit activities because I didn't want to be called anti-Muslim. Look what happens in the UK. The Midlands Police yeah. Force knew about a child sex trafficking trafficking and rape gang for 10 plus years. Innocent children, one child was murdered, were being trafficked and raped on a massive scale and the police didn't do anything. And when they testified and they were asked why they didn't you know, bust them earlier, they didn't want to be called anti-Muslim. And look what happens, I mean, Ahmed the clock kid mm -hmm. in Texas exactly. comes to school with something that looks like And the it. president of the United States on the one hand says, see something, say something, yeah, except when you see someone Ackman. looking like, exactly. Yeah. You know, this is exactly the danger of political correctness. And to me, I just don't understand, the, even the argument doesn't make sense. If it's anti-Muslim to speak out against terrorism, what then is pro-Muslim? Is yeah. that not yeah. the racist statement? Yeah. Thanks for watching. Click here to never miss a Rebel update. Want even more of the Rebel? Well, click here to become a premium member.